Ladies and ghouls, so happy new year. Welcome to 2019. I haven't actually stopped my Pinscription subscription. I've just been slowly piling all the boxes up and not opening them. Um, and I still have loads of space for more pins. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna post this picture on my Instagram. So I am super excited because not only am I in my snuggliest cat jumper, um, but I have some surprise packages to open with you. I am actually in love with this. But here are the limited edition Halloween boots. So I got a message on my Instagram the other day from a company called Painted Witch Designs. You in the camera, you're a star. So apparently my cat's stolen my seat today. So these are some like Halloween slash Christmas slash some things I bought from Simply Gothic. So um, Mike's gonna drive me up and me and Mike are going to uh, London Edge. Hi everyone who's just joined. <laughs> um. <laughs> Basically I was meant to be going out tonight but England decided to be covered in snow with no real warning. Um, so I am currently stuck in my house. <laughs> so this is Trevor's house. Um, Trevor is a gerbil. Um, so at the beginning of the year, I posted my Halloween withdrawal symptom giveaway and this included goodies from loads and loads of different companies. I am completely obsessed with Killstar. I know that Killstar is relatively expensive, but where else can you buy cat glasses with bats and stars on? So, just saying. October 31st did do a whole like release thing basically saying he was gonna have some new creepy company but definitely would completely cover a double bed straight up just wearing it like <laughs> as a uh, poncho. <laughs> spooky life has to take priority um, so this month's spooky box club is creepy cozy themes. Okay so basically as you can see this board was having none of it all just cracked. Now this is one of their newer pins, I believe it was four ninety nine. I thought we peeked at the ghost, right? The ghost itself gave me heart palpitations, but I've literally just looked at this necklace for a whole 0.3 of a second and I already think I may marry this necklace. Uh, I've planned our wedding, it's going to be in October, there's going to be leaves down the aisle. Can we just, just give them to people, don't throw them at people. So anyway, thank you so so much to Cody. from Simply Gothic and Simply Gothic is one of the best gift givers I have ever met because today I'm going to be showing you some things from Sourpuss. And I just, I'm actually in love. And then the front does have super glittery writing and it's not hard to tell that I love glitter. It seems like you are suffering from a very severe case of pumpkin mania. We really, really do hope that you will come and find us over on Facebook because we are the Haunted Ghoul Group. Oh goodness, I hope it's not contagious. It seems to be in fantastic shape. There's no like bottom marks on it from when someone sat on it. Um, so yeah, hopefully everything in here is okay. Definitely is a super like floral scent that is so gorgeous and I cannot wait to use that. The chunky platform to the bottom of them um, and they are beautiful. Does that mean that you then can't wear spooky spiderweb dresses? No, you can wear whatever you like. 
Okay, number five. What is the minimum requirement to be considered a goth? Following on from what I just said, if you feel like you're a goth, if you want to be a goth, you can be one. So basically, I'm going to be dyeing my hair with henna today. I don't know if I would want to have done, like, do this every time I dye my hair. So this is why I did two different purchases through lay by because I wanted to see what happened when I bought more than one item. So I was really, really excited when I got an Instagram message from a company called Good Witch Goods. So, ooh, okay, this is really exciting. So this theme is a ghoul's work is never done. Just need a stopwatch, um, because it says leave these on, like, the normal time's about 10 minutes, but leave them on longer for, like, them to be darker brown and, like, less for lighter brown. So I'm just gonna like basically mess around for a while until I feel like it's enough. It feels like it could be a lag. Oh my goodness. And it's also very jingly jangly. It is quite a kind of beastie belt definitely kind of thicker and more heavier than the belts which I have had in the past but this is a Coulter skating dress um, and this does retail at $39.99 definitely I'm really pleased with how much greenery there is in this one compared to the smaller one here and then I get it in real life and it's like another level of amazing like in real life you're like what is featuring both me, Mike, and my chameleon, Jeff, who I love. But do bear in mind that I have sewn it down the front of this dress, um, so it did look very, very different when I did originally receive it. And she's so, so, so kindly, like I cannot say enough so's, um, she so kindly offered to send me one because she has such a large collection that she should get my And the theme this month is, ooh, conspiracy theories. I am so excited about this. Um, and she offered to send me a box to show to you guys. And of course, I was like, yes, please. Let's go see the fish. So here is the town. We've just come to like the end of the walkway thingy there. Uh, apparently there's no way to get down this way, so we have to walk all the way back. I'm doing this as a collaboration with Ashling O'Neill. So hey baby kitten. Yes. This realm of being there for this person, like, I don't mean not as a friend, I mean they took advantage of you, like, I, I used to have a friend that... This is really weird, I don't think I want to go into too much detail to do with this, but I definitely have like a person in mind which this very directly links to. <laughs> Go ahead and start opening these inscription unboxings. I think I've got them in the right order. An idea. We worked together to kind of create a design, although he was the, <laughs> the main design and drawer in this scenario. I just added in a few little things. You may notice the bat has green eyes. have just been hula hooping as you may have just seen. 
So on the top we have again their logo on their actual website and then it says Happy Halloween Soy Candle and then on the side it says Spooky Fruity. If they have any Halloween mugs, see if it truly is an orange alert. Albert, so please enjoy the ride. I'm sorry it's a super long video, but I just had so much fun setting up this house <laughs> and moving him in basically. Um, packing my bag, sorting out my animals, things like that. So I thought I'd bring you along from today since today is the preparation day. So today... Hi guys. ...is Sunday and it's Mike's dad's birthday. So we're going out for breakfast at this place that we went to breakfast at before. So yeah. Hi guys, always remember to vlog when you drive. Anyone in the polling shows know how to turn the overhead light on a timer. The whole room lit up at 8 and also it's an effective as an alarm there seems to be no snooze option. Um, and then we had some various suggestions about taking the bowl bow. Um, so I sent a picture of the light so everyone could see how light it was. And then Mike decided to take it apart and it turns out it's just a load of mirrors just up to the up to the ceiling and it turns out it it's just the sun like that's just the sun shining in <coughs> tufted duck i believe actually it's called um we have no idea what it's like we just heard that it's good i've still got the same <laughs> necklace on from yesterday i've excited to finally be sitting down to finally announce that finally TK Maxx and HomeSense have started stocking Halloween things. It is a ghost as well. This one's very upfront and confident whereas this one's a bit more shy and he's just kind of looking out. He's like, hey, have you got any candy for me? Actually, I guess it would be like, have you got any dreamies? And I just love this piece. I'm so in love with this piece. I am like genuinely so happy. Not as light as last month's box. And here is the sticker. It says the witch's garden. Bought this for £2.50. It was amazing from Sainsbury's. Little spooner. Here's Trevor's new bougie apartment. So spooky and so happy. And Home Sense has started putting their Halloween stuff in stores. And it's code orange and I've got Halloween stuff and I've got bath stuff. And they're just life complete, like everything is so good and I'm so happy and I'm sure, you know, I'll be getting another snow globe soon. And then the next thing that I have to show you today is oh, a salute to last year. <laughs> Through the end and that's literally it. And I think it's like the smile just like reminded me of like this kind of an item. It's my room! I am hot and... I'm tired and I've got to go to school in the morning. Enjoy the handmade jewelry, Simone Rochelle, singer songwriter from Cornwall. Cannot wait for spooky season so I can just send all these out to everyone. Because not only is it a black cat with green eyes, but also it has a little fat Trevor boy. I had to get them because look, they're like little matching ones. The ghosties. Um, but it is a really like snuggly and like the fact it isn't like super fluffy isn't a big deal. I kind of got them and I knew what they felt like um, so I kind of kept it in here to show you so this is the dress that I got and it is in a doll dress style and honestly like again I just feel horrendous for it there's my TARDIS that I'm doing out
basically freezing. Try a Have you got any apples? Can you go to the greengrocer? Where's the greengrocer then? But let me take out the goods. So basically, Regions and Beyond did reach out to me a couple of months ago. So you only just put the pumpkins in. Uh, Ooh, <laughs> October. <laughs> See you later. Woo, October. Bye then. Ah. Oh, I've just um, filed this nail so it's a bit straighter. Is, is it feel pointy? Yeah. Yeah. It is a bit pointy. Oh, okay, so this box is called Let's Get Lost. Oh, the smell is so good. Get to the goods inside. And it's called the Delora Velvet Dress. Um, it just appears. So, oh, cute. So this one is called Dark Dreams. I'm gonna go on like a twisty audio kind of a thing. Gonna get yeah. <laughs> yeah. When you realise that the Christmas pudding has eyes. So little Captain Jack's come to the front this morning so I thought I'd just quickly show you him. <sighs> this is quite literally my favourite part of, I was going to say October, but pretty much the whole year. <laughs> um, every year for the last, I think this is the fourth year or perhaps the fifth year, I have been doing a Halloween swap box. <gasps> yes. Mmm amazing anyway thank you very much for watching i hope that you have a spooktacular halloween if you do have any questions comments please leave them down below if it's anywhere you are i hope you're enjoying the shade and i will see you next time bye